student loan borrowers are officially in limbo as of right now. And that is because the next court date as it relates to the SAVE plan and IDR forgiveness as a whole. So you know that uh, agreement that we've all made where we've been sending our financial information to the federal government for years uh, with the understanding that after 20 or 25 years, our loans would be discharged. Yes, that is at risk too. It's not just a SAVE plan. It is literally IDR, discharge, relief, forgiveness as a whole, okay? So a lot of this is really, you know, it, it's possibly on the chopping block in, in reality. The next court date is going to be October 15th with the Eighth Circuit Court of Appeals. Um, until that court date, there is really going to be no new information unless the Department of Education states, hey, we're going to give you another forbearance and make it last longer. Um, but right now they haven't released that information. They haven't said anything about it. I mean, that is a possibility because right now with the save plan, if that forbearance ends and there is no resolution, they're going to have to find another plan to put people into. It is going to cause a big disruption. A lot of people, their payments may possibly go up. And then just, I can only imagine um, the confusion among borrowers and servicers alike of what to do next, right? Um, because they have gotten rid of repayee. They already sunset that. So now there's less IDR plans available for you to even enroll in. But truly, we won't know anything until after that hearing, if we even know anything then, because it's a likelihood that they could say, come back next month, right? I mean, that's what you've been seeing with a lot of, um, you know, these court dates where they may extend it and say, okay, come back and bring us this, that we'll hear this other argument on another date. So we really don't know if there will even be any level of resolution at that point. Um, but yeah, that's really what's, what's going on right now, guys, is that everyone's really in limbo. The fresh start uh, has ended, right? So if you have federal student loans to rent default and you haven't enrolled in the fresh start program, that's, that's a wrap that's over and done with for you. You will not have any access to um, deferment, forbearance, or even be able to enroll in any IDR plans. And the government can now start coming after you, uh, garnishing your wages, garnishing your social security. Uh, and also destroying your credit. So there's a lot going on right now with student loans. I'll let you guys know um, whenever I hear more information. But as of now, I don't really think there's going to be much to provide until the October 15th court date. Um, and I have to check my calendar, but it may be around um, some off days for me. So I may not be able to report the moment that comes out, but I'll check and I'll see. And like I said, when I hear things, I will keep you guys uh, up to date. So let me know your thoughts on this one, guys, and I'll speak to you on the next one.